Okay, so today we're cooking quesadillas. And uh, it's not really a big deal. You need a frying pan, a stove, uh, put some oil in the pan. It doesn't have to be, uh, you know, any special oil. It should be extra virgin olive oil. You let that stuff not get on the pan because it's a non-stick and then uh, you throw in one of these whole wheat tortillas and then uh, you gotta cut up some cheese I like to use what is it pepper jack cheese I should do this for the camera so people can see anyway. You cut up this cheese and then you put it around the edge. And the reason you put it around the edge is so that it acts like a glue and holds all the junk in there. Hope you people in the back can see this. Okay, then after you put the cheese in, we're going to add a little more cheese to make sure it sticks. After you put the cheese in, then you add black beans, which are the can's already been opened and drained for you. So we put a little black beans around the edge. That also helps hold in all the junk. Then you add some broccoli. This has been pre-steamed over here. If you don't have any pre-steamed broccoli, get your neighbor to do it for you. Throw a couple of those in there. Then we have some pre-roasted peppers that were roasted in a similar pan as this with just a little oil. Throw a couple of roasted peppers in there. Then we're going to cut up a tomato. I like to use these Campari tomatoes. I don't know where they came from. Mexico, I guess. Throw that tomato in there like that. Then I'm going to cut up this funny looking pepper here. I don't know what, what it is. I got it from the grocery store. I kind of, I think it's semi-hot. I'm going to try a piece to see how hot it is. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. No, I'm just kidding. It's not really that hot. kind of like right on the edge of the hot sweet border. Okay, so now that you got all that stuff in there, see? And the camera's getting all screwed up. Oh boy. <laughs> TV people are going to kill me about this. All right. So now that you got this in here, you want to just grab the edge of the tortilla and flip it over like that. And then take a spatula and mash it down real good. Okay. And you let that cook on medium for about three or four minutes. While 
you're waiting, you need to have an IPA beer. Make sure it's IPA and not Budweiser or some crap like that. Oh, that's good. That's going to make the take quesadilla taste better, too. Okay, basically that's it. I mean, you let this thing sit there for a few minutes, and you flip it over on the other side. Hopefully some of the cheese leaks out on the edge and gets burnt on the pan. That adds some flavor. And uh, then you turn on the news, or whatever, a movie, and you eat your dinner. Hope this has been educational, everybody.